Hi, this is Dumb Day for Kanji Memories with a video to help you remember the Japanese kanji for bosom. See kanjimemories.com for an introduction, or just follow along, and all will become clear. We start with the green kanji memories card. On the left is the symbol for the moon. Nearby is the symbol for meat or flesh. Written carelessly, one soon turned into the other, and so the moon symbol is sometimes used, as here, to mean part of the body, or flesh. The symbol on the right side used to be the complete kanji for the chest. One theory is that it is a pictogram, describing the ribs enclosing the lungs which have air inside, the X standing for the air in this case. And now our kanji memories memory card, which shows a dramatic performer, perhaps an opera singer, emptying her lungs in order to complete an intense section of the show. It takes real power to be able to project your voice in this way. This looks like a good evening out and we are sure that the audience are enjoying themselves. We can put the two cards together, then look at the suggested association. Lungs are an empty box, wrapped in ribs and with extra flesh we call our bosom. The right-hand side of this kanji is quite complicated but you can build it up this way. Lungs are an empty box, wrapped in ribs and with extra flesh we call our bosom. So, start with an open box with an X in it, put a wrapping enclosure around it then add some flesh. It is not too difficult when taken a step at a time. So, where do we find this kanji used? Here are two examples. You will shortly hear the Japanese for each, with the second and third repeats spoken slowly. Kabuki no kashu no mune ga kanjou de yure ugoita. Kabuki no kashu no mune ga kanjou de yure ugoita. Kabuki no kashu no mune ga kanjou de yure ugoita. Isha wa teinei ni kyoubu kensa o okonatta. And that completes this Kanji Memories video. We really hope that you found it useful, and that you will visit our main website, kanjimemories.com, for our latest resources.